Hi friends. So I'm thinking a lot about my project that I'm working on. About five years ago, I bought a little piece of property out in the adjoining town called Roca Blanca or Cacolotepec. And it's in a fraccionamento, so it's kind of a new neighborhood, but I'm, I'm understanding that more people are building up there. So now it's kind of the time I was waiting till they put in power and water. And I think they're starting to get these utilities to this fraccionamento, so I'm excited actually. And I've had a lot of time to think about it. My property is kind of up on a hill right next to a ravine. It has ocean views. It's not right on the ocean because those are expensive, but it has ocean views. You can see over the, the palm trees. You can see, you can see the ocean is there. So I'm pretty excited about that property. What I'd like to build. So in this town, Roca Blanca, it's a town of about a thousand. And there's a Spanish school there where there's always a housing need. And so I was kind of, um, the property I bought for like two, 2,200 US dollars. And my thought is I could build a like a rustic, I guess, depending on how much time, money, and energy I could build it to whatever level of finish, but I was thinking 10 meters circular building. I really like circular structures. I visited 10 or 20 in this area, built out of different materials. There's structured insulated panels. That's kind of all the rage. My friend works at a fabrica. A couple of my friends work for a pastor who who makes these structure insulated panels which is cement and foam insulated in cement and it has a high R value like insulating value which is important it's earthquake and hurricane and mildew resistant and most importantly it insulates it actually insulates so I was considering the and they they go up fast like it's they're prefab so you kind of and build more tradition. I don't. Traditional is not the right word. You build more. Mm, well, okay. This house I'm in, it's built out of these panels, and it, I like it. Alternately, everyone else builds out of cement blocks or or also the red brick. So, okay, here's the options: SIP panel, red brick, the block. Like the cement block is probably one of the most affordable and strong ways, but they become like an oven. It becomes so hot, it has zero R value. <laughs> and another option I really like, because I'm wild, is adobe. So if you have a good hat and good boots, so you'd need a, a cement foundation. I'd like to actually do stone, like a stonework masonry foundation. And then that's kind of the boot. So basically this adobe can't get wet. It's not good with earthquakes or hurricanes. So what you'd have to do is you'd have to put um, a good boot and a good hat. So good roof system. But that's still my preference, I think, because it has the R value. It has... Um, it has a lot going for it. And there's great clay in this area. There's, adobe is kind of a dying art, I think, in this area, because it's labor intensive, because they don't last as long, because there's more, it's not as easy, I guess. But if you had a good stucco exterior, that would protect it. If you had a good, like, post and beam type system, with the castillos like they built here and then the infill with adobe that's kind of what i'm thinking i don't know let me know let me know what you think if you want to come down and help me build an adobe hut let me know really i should put something on this land because if you leave land empty and you, you do have to go clean it up but if you leave it empty too long then, then people will like 
I mean, there is a tendency for people to try to like sell it from under you or, or go start living there and say it belongs to them, etc. So once, once you buy property, I fence it off right away. That's what you have to do. And you have to go clean it up regularly and kind of make your presence known, get someone to watch it for you. Um, but then once you put a structure on, then it's more securely yours. So that's kind of what I'm thinking. Who wants to come do an adobe building class or who wants to help me build this project? Let me know. Peace.